It's all carbon fiber. The boats only weigh 165 pounds. They're fragile as hell on directions that they're not designed to take and stronger than all get out, kind of like an eggshell. Treat the egg the way the chicken intended, it's real strong. Just hit it on the side and bad things happen. I've chosen not to go in the foiling direction uh, because there's a new boat every year. The floaters, you got a clean shape that goes through the water. It's only got to be a water sailing device. The foils are kind of frozen in time. That's the definition of a floater. And it's still the coolest sailboat I've ever sailed. They're so quick that if you twitch the helm, it will throw you in the water. You got a job, you better grab the hiking strap and go across carefully or dive in a real controlled way because the boat's moving all three axes all the time. These boats have got so much sail area and so much power that in about seven or eight knots of breeze will fly in a hull from the trapeze and any breeze up from there you're depowering and uh, you control mass rotation and so you can change from a sail that's got that kind of camber to one like this and then twist the top off and you can move the twist down the sail to load it just for what you can manage. You're looking for wind, you're looking for angle, you're looking at your competition. It, it's sailboat racing, it's just conducted at high speed.